seems to be a trend. 5,042 votes to 2622, which is 6633, otherwise known as 2 to 1. Joe Tabby. Yeah. 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 something different and a little something different did happen and we won the 109th seat and kept it in the Democratic column by about 16 percent and it was a great day for me and it's you people in this room that made that possible it is you made the greatest opportunity in my life possible to be able to serve my community so it's a real humbling moment to be here before you two years later, and with this decisive victory for all of us, for the people of the world. I'm proud to be a Democrat, and I'm proud to be a Danbury Democrat. All right? Doing it now. That's right. <laughs> That's right, Chad. We're going to do it now. And something else great came out of this race. I couldn't have done it without my family, the DTC's faith in me, my friends in here that have supported me, your unwavering support. But something else great came out of this race, and it's proof that this party, the Democratic Party, is the party that is growing in Danbury, That's right. that is being rejuvenated by new young stars like Billy Taylor. <laughs> My campaign manager, all right? The future of the Democratic Party in Danbury. We've got a bright future because of guys like him, and I'm just so thankful for all of you for having my back. Two and a half years ago, this is our victory, and I just hope that my good friends who are running in the second district, Jason Bartlett, Bill Melillo, my, my good friend, Dwayne Perkins, I just hope that they win because they deserve it, and they've run some great races, and I'm very proud of them. Okay. Go Danbury Democrats!